Hello and welcome back to RSM Custom Guitars and thank you again for joining me for part two of the guitar stage build. Okay so today we're going to concentrate on the neck. Um, we've got this lovely piece of maple here that I've pre-prepared. Um, the neck's going to be predominantly the maple running through the centre and then for the flanks we're going to use this uh, African Oroco. So we're going to firstly draw out the shape of the neck with the angled headstock. Once we've done that we're going to cut it out on the bandsaw. Then we're going to transpose the shape on the Oroco and then cut that out and then we're going to glue them together and then after we've done that after some time once it's cured we are going to uh, route out the truss rod cavity and insta install the, the truss rod so quite a lot to be getting on with let's crack on
Now this would be nice and accurate and when we uh, come to sticking this together it won't sort of slop about as it's sort of multi-laminate.
Okay, so now we have the neck clamped up, and this is going to be drying and curing for the next sort of 12 to 24 hours, which is a bit of a pain in the neck when you just want to get on. So anyway, recently I've just invested in a new piece of kit. Bought this from the same shop as a Gandalf bought his thunder stick. The missus loves it. Uh, helps her do the cooking in half the time, and it's going to help us bosh through the uh, through the project just that bit quicker. So anyway, these are the uh, three magic words: fish, bash, bosh. Okay, so that should have done it. Now I'm just going to take the clamps off and then take off the rest of this dry glue. <laughs> 